when my bike broke down, instead of going to my dad, I said, no, I'm gonna fix it myself. That's like one of my earliest memories of what you would call engineering. I didn't grow up, I guess, looking at a specific stereotype of engineer and that helped me a lot because I didn't try and put myself in a box. I was always like really good at my sciences and maths, but then I was really good at art as well and I like loved my creative side. It's not that specific image of an engineer and you don't have to be that or fit that to be an accomplished engineer. And by that I mean how much you can contribute to the world. Product design engineering. Aeronautical engineering. Civil engineering. Biomedical engineering. Mechanical engineering. Such a dynamic field and it goes from everything to prosthetic limbs to high-speed aircraft. I think probably what groups all engineers together is the ability and also like determination to solve a problem. We see all this um, kind of fascinating technology around us and we're inspired by how it works but also that you feel that you can make a difference. You improve the quality of people's lives, you improve well-being as well. It's something that you're not exactly taught in a lecture hall. It's something that you learn along the way. My colleagues, my academics, people I've met here throughout my time here have really given me an understanding of why this place is really special. The engineering heritage, it's not just a thing from the past. Most of the lectures that you'll get here are doing cutting edge, live research that is at the forefront of the industry. The societies that Glasgow University offer is like so fast and so many different types you can get involved in. We're open to everyone and everyone can contribute in any different way. Different ideas, it's different backgrounds, people come in with completely different perspectives. We're a learning society as much as anything. We teach things that you do learn in your degree, we build on them and we also teach things that you don't learn in your degree. Not just to feel like our job is done once we've designed something and just put it out there. We like to follow it through. We like to follow, you know, the story of the people. We have a passion for what we do. We strive towards trying to help society in any way that we can. And that's not through logic or theory, but through feeling. Without feeling, you cannot have engineering.